Hello and welcome back to our family travel channel. In today's video, we're gonna take you out to Casperson Beach and show you why we regard this to be one of the top beaches in all of Sarasota County. If you are new to our channel, we are the Puddles and Passports family. We have been traveling now full time for the past two years. We spent a lot of time in Europe, Thailand, Australia, and now we're back here in the US and we upload weekly travel guides, tips and more. So if that sounds something like you're interested in, tap the subscribe button and follow along. Okay, let's go and have a look at this beach. Ashley, before we take you onto the beach, I wanted to show you some of the amenities that are out here. You've got this pavilion with these parking benches, and then over there, you've got a pretty cool play skate for the kiddos. So there's quite a few nice amenities here that make this beach a really nice place to come and visit. And then you've got at least three parking areas. This one here is one of the overflow parking, and then up towards the top, which we'll head there now, um, you've got the two main parking areas. So we'll walk up there. So this is one of the two main parking areas. When you're driving in, on your left, you'll see a parking area, which is a little bit bigger than this, but this one actually brings you closer to the beach. And over there, that's the public restrooms. And uh, there's some showers over there as well. You also have a lot of these areas here like this where you've got picnic tables overlooking the water. So another thing that I love about Casperton Beach is these walkways, uh, these boardwalks uh, that run alongside the beach. You've got more showers there. And then here is Casperson Beach. continue walking down again you just see so many people that are just out here shifting for shark's teeth and I'm going to leave a link in the description to a video that my daughter and I made last year and it also goes into explaining why there's so many shark's teeth in this area which is pretty cool okay I'm going to show you a quick 360 so you can see exactly what I'm seeing out here and you can see why we think Casperson Beach such a special and different type of beach. Again, don't get us wrong, we absolutely love Siesta Beach, Lido Beach, Nokomis Beach, all of the local beaches here are absolutely fantastic, but if you're looking to just lay on the beach and catch the rays, then yeah, some of those bigger, wider beaches might be better for you, but you're looking to be a little bit more active, Casperson Beach certainly got you covered. And shortly we'll show you another reason why when we head back behind those trees. Like you see here, you've got these palm trees that have clearly been here a long time and just they just add a little bit of an element of desert island-like feel to the place. Okay, so that's just a short walk on Casperson Beach. So what I'm gonna do now is we're gonna take you back behind these palm trees here so you can see exactly what's behind there um, I think you're gonna like what you see let's go okay as you're walking to the beach from the parking lot instead of turning right to jump onto the beach there take a left and let me show you what's back here and as you come back here there's a trail that goes for just over two miles and it runs alongside the beach parallel to the beach lined with all these beautiful palm trees overhanging. A lot of it is sand, so it's an easy walk. So obviously it's very flat, needless to say. But yeah, look at that. Such a beautiful little hike. And then what I like to do is I'll come out here, I'll hike out as far as I can go. And then in a minute, I'm gonna show you some of these really cool cut throughs that are scattered along this trail that take you back to the beach. Okay, here's an example of one of the cut throughs and they're scattered all along this trail. So at any moment, you can just decide to turn back and walk along the beach. So they just bring you out. Look at that. So you get the best of both worlds out here. You get a beautiful hike in nature and then you get to have a nice hike along the ocean. Look at that, isn't it just beautiful out here? Imagine if you're out here on your own. See what I mean? How it feels like it's almost like a, a desert island. OK, 
Okay, I'm gonna make my way back. There's one more thing I wanna show you and then we'll wrap it up. Yeah, so let us know in the comments what you think about this beach. Is this your kind of beach or would you prefer big, open, wide sand beaches where you can just laze all day? Or do you like to come to beaches where it's a little bit more active like this one? Okay, as you're leaving the beach, one thing that's worth checking out over by the showers there and the toilets is what I like to call shark teeth sidewalk. So what you'll see, I'm gonna point the camera down here, is these slabs here where people have paid for and then they've put shark's teeth into their slabs. And then over here, you'll see a whole bunch of them, hundreds of them, shark's teeth. They're all added into the sidewalk. And as you can see, there's literally tons of them. Okay, that's the wrap. If you enjoyed this video, please tap the like button. And if you want to see more travel related content, there should be two videos on your screen right now. One is from our Casperson Beach shark teeth hunting experience. And the other one is a Florida playlist. If you don't see the links on the screen right now, check out the description. We'll leave a link down there. And while you're in our description, we've also left a link to all our travel gear and accessories that we use to help you plan your next adventure and make sure you're more prepared. Okay, as always, happy travels.